good morning children hope you all are doing good and hope all are fit and fine children today we are going to start with chapter 1 evolution of computers how computers that we are using today laptops personal computers tablets smartphones how these computers modern day computers came into existence how they got evolved so we are going to see in this chapter so let's start children every aspect of our life in this present era is influenced by computers yes we are greatly affected by computers almost every in our every phase of life we need computers whether it it is the communication whether it is some booking uh, some shopping so we need computers the widespread use of computers has made them indispensable at almost every workplace yes indispensable meaning now all um, now any work is not possible without computers almost in every area every field every place we need computers so it has become uh, an important part of our life computers you must have visited uh, various places so and you must have seen computers so computers are used extensively in banks hospitals media and entertainment offices factories schools homes space and research railways airports and so on so many other places also so children do you know the term computer has been derived from the word compute which means to calculate but the computer systems are not limited to perform only calculations right it can do many other things it can do many other work or tasks other than calculations so it is a versatile device it has so many applications in it and using those applications we can do different types of work we can listen to songs movie we can play games we can study something so we can do many other things apart from calculations but children do you know how these computers came into existence see the present day computer is entirely different from the earlier devices that were invented for doing calculations so this uh, history started from uh, when early men early man uh, used some uh, uh, things like stones or pebbles for counting uh, anything so this idea led to the uh, invention of calculators or calculating devices so let's see let's uh, have a glance through the milestones that led to the evolution of present day computers history of computers the need to keep track of numbers led to the invention of different calculating devices so we will see uh, different calculating devices from uh, different places uh, from france from germany scotland there are many uh, mathematicians from different places uh from china from scotland from germany from french they invented different calculating devices so uh, and this calculating devices started from abacus this was the first counting device and many devices were invented leading to the development of computers so let's see the calculating devices abacus abacus you must have done in your maths activity also so many of you uh, must be having the idea about uh, abacus and how to use it for doing calculations 
so abacus was the first mechanical device for calculations mechanical device meaning it had moving parts the beads could be moved for doing calculations it was developed in china so it had uh, a wooden frame which had uh, two parts heaven and earth and uh, heaven in heaven uh, the rods had two beads and the rods in earth had five beads so the rods represented the place value of digits and by moving the beads we could represent the numbers and we would do the calculations so this abacus was uh, um, could do uh, addition subtraction multiplication and division even now the abacus is used in many countries like china japan even in india in our country also and uh, abacus uh, the modern day abacus is uh, are used for very large and complicated calculations as well next is napier's bones napier's bones was invented by sir john napier who was a scottish mathematician in 1614 now this device was made up of rods which on which the numbers were marked and one rod was there uh, which was used as multiplier so this device could do addition subtraction multiplication and division next device was pascalin calculator Blaise Pascal who was a French mathematician invented the first mechanical calculator at the age of 19 in the year 1642 that's quite appreciating now this uh, calculator had gears wheels and dials the numbers were displayed by rotating the wheels gears were used to control the wheels and dials how much uh, the wheels to be moved uh, the dials were used for now this calculator was capable of uh, performing addition subtraction multiplication and division so the principle this gear principle gear principle uh, children you must have also heard in case of vehicles right uh, in auto rickshaws in um, taxis uh, in our vehicles there there are speedometers okay so meters they could uh, show us the distance right uh, they could show the fare also in taxi meter the fare is also displayed so that was the device which could uh, um, measure the distance okay and according to the distance the fare was calculated so this gear principle uh, was further employed in many mechanical calculators next is step reckoner this is also called as leibniz calculator leibniz the famous german mathematician invented a calculator which he named as step reckoner in 1674 now uh, this uh, leibniz calculator or the step reckoner was an improvement over pascaline calculator pascaline calculator could do addition subtraction multiplication and division uh, so the improvement on over the uh, pascaline calculator was now this step reckoner could also do square roots next is jacquard's loom in 1801 joseph joseph jacquard a french inventor weaver and merchant invented a power loom for weavers which could weave fabric designs so fabric designs uh, Uh, fabric designs uh, the uh, we the for those we need threads okay but the movement of those threads 
was controlled by the wooden punched cards okay you can see in the picture the cards and the punching is done so according to these cards the thread movement was done and the fabric was designed now from here the punched cards were used were uh, also uh, started as using input devices okay for many other um, machines or devices also so this also led to the invention of the input device punched cards which we will study how uh, they were also used in first generation computers so children today we have seen calculating devices five calculating devices abacus napier's bones pascaline calculator step reckoner and jacquard's loom so uh, i shall end my video here uh, in next video we shall see more calculating devices and we shall uh, move further with the other topics of the chapter so let me know if you have any questions please understand the video and make notes uh, make uh, some important notes practice spellings okay let me know if you have any questions thank you